Hi, it's Michael from DNA here, and in the next few minutes you're going to learn about using the classic add citation window in Zotero. Now the classic add citation window is a tool that you can use which gives you a bit more functionality when you want to add citations into your Word documents. If you like this way of working, it's very easy to set it up in Zotero so that it defaults to this way of working when you start the program. So here we are in Word, and just as we did in previous videos, we're going to go up to add-ins and we're going to click on the first button here, uh, insert citation. So you may be familiar with this red box which is uh, giving you an opportunity to type in the name of the person that you want to cite at this point. However, instead we're going to click on this little drop down arrow and we're going to choose Classic View. Now Classic View is great because it just gives you a number of options for the way that you put citations in. For instance, if we look at this paragraph, we can see that uh, Solovi and Mayer are already mentioned at the beginning of this paragraph, so all we want is the date at the end. So we can do a little search if we can't see it immediately, and there they are, and we can click on Suppress Author, and then when we click on OK, you just get the date inserted at that point. Now, another example of the ways you can use this box is if, uh, if we click at the end of this paragraph, and we go and add another citation again, again back into Classic View, is the fact that this paragraph might be relevant to a couple of different authors that we want to cite. So we could choose the Multiple Sources button at the bottom of the screen. And I'm just going to choose a couple of different articles here. Let's have Emotional Style there. Let's have this one as well. And you can change the order of these items in the citation by using these arrows. So if I click here, and then click on this arrow, then it will put this article first. Now when I click OK, we get a combined citation which features both names and both dates as well. Now there's numerous other features in the classic citation box. I'd urge you to have a look at it and experiment with some of the tools. And if you decide that it's something that you enjoy working with, you can set up Zotero so that whenever you insert a citation, it will default immediately to the classic citation box. And this is how. Back in Firefox, we choose the Zotero button at the top of the screen, just click on it. And then we go down to the little cog in Zotero, the Actions button. And from within there, we go to Preferences. Now, if you have the Site tab highlighted at the top of the Zotero Preferences dialog box, you should find that there is a Use Classic Ad Citation dialog tick box there that we can tick. I'm just going to add a tick in there and click OK. Now what we should find is when we go back into Word, if I uh, just jump to the end of a sentence, go into Add-ins, and then click on the Add Citation box, instead of the red bar, we now have the Classic Citation box, which is coming up by default.